Fuck it. Hey y'all, how you doing? Got that good lighting so, at this hour. Turn it off because they have been demonetizing me all month long. Happy Vlogtober. It is October 24th and I have a special guest. You heard her voice. I am getting ready to use a hair hydrating mask. Oh, I'm sorry, wrong thing. First things first. A detox hair mask first to remove buildup because my client is needing a silk press, okay? A silky silk press. And it's been a long time since I've done that. This is charcoal based. So I'm gonna put this on her hair first because I wanna detox all this product off of her hair using the new product line that I have been loving. And then we're gonna shampoo condition. Can you guys tell who it is just yet? We're gonna be using a lot of this product cause she got a lot of hair. See these curls? We're gonna be using steam today as well, making sure the hair is nice and moisturized because we want the silk press to silk press, okay? It's homecoming season, right? So are you ready to, to show your face? Well, I'm pretty sure I already did on that. <laughs> yes. She had her hair in a ponytail when she came in. Y'all didn't miss no before. So I just blasted it with hot water and I'm putting this mask on. So just detoxing this, the hair, especially around her hairline where she likes to lay her edges. We gotta get all that, let's just call it what it is, that gunk. Off. I haven't really been doing my edges lately. No, they actually. weren't bad. So get all that off and then pull it through the ends. I want to start right now with putting in the moisture in her hair. That's why I have the steam going so it can get all the way up into that cortex of the hair and into that scalp because we got to make sure the scalp doesn't have any buildup too so that when we're soap pressing we're not smoking up the place. You know what I'm talking about? Look at these curls already bouncing though. Like they're like yes. Inner scents come through. I love it. So yeah, got Miss Sammy in the salon today, guys. Bring your phone all the way back so I want them to see your scalp. Can you yeah. see it? Yeah, now tilt it down. There you go. All right, and we'll come back whenever we start blow drying. What a blow. Do I get to turn off the music? I know, but I'm trying to turn off the music. This song is too good. I can pop it. Okay, perfect. Pausing the music. Uh. So this is our before. I'm gonna use the Hair Love Prep Spray. This is good for body style retention and thermal care, which we're about to use a lot of thermal, i.e. heat. Look at Samira yawning. <laughs> okay, you know my shampoos are good when I make Samira be quiet. So we're gonna section this off so that we get good, consistent blowouts. And then we're gonna follow up with our flat ironing. So I take it you like this brush? Mm, I don't really use it. The one at home? Yeah, I didn't really use it. I I used it. it. Yeah, I used it a couple times. The first time I used it, I liked the way like my curls were. Like in when you were air down? No, it was when I did the half a pack down when we first came to the salon. After the hurricane, I did a half a pack down. It had like two. Yeah, this brush that I'm using on here? Yes. There's one at the house. I know. Yeah, I use it on my hair. Okay. That's but I did the half a pack down. Yeah, I guess my timing is off because I haven't had this since I got this place. No, I'm saying after the hurricane. Oh, okay, yeah. When you did come with me that day when I was getting my stuff in. Yeah, don't remind me. <laughs> I feel like I just stopped sharing that and I'm like, I'm not talking about it. For sure. So we're using the smoothing cream, which has been great for keeping moisture during the process of soap pressing. Let's do this clip. I'm not gonna go in here. Brush through the prep spray. So what are you thinking about your color now? I feel like my it's gotta hair, be pretty when it's straight. Yeah, I feel that's like my hair that's growing in now is like darker than the color. It is. Which I didn't fucking know that. But yeah, so I feel like it was more red before, but now it's like less like whenever I see it in the light, like sometimes like little glimpses of it, then it looks kinda of red, but not as much anymore. I see a lot of red. Like auburn brick color. You doing this in a part? Side part. I forgot. I forgot what it is. A side part chick. All the other young girls be with that middle part stuff. It's not over here. Well, yeah, I need it like flat ironed into the middle part for the cell that I'm doing. So, so you do want it center part? Yeah. No, I said I need it flat ironed into the side part. I you said center. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's how relaxed you are. What side? Yeah. This way, right? Yes. Right there? Yep. I think last time I had silk press was. What month is Easter in? Uh, April? Or am I lying? Mm, either way, it was like April or May. I don't think, no, it's definitely April.
Where do I hold it? Right there. We are coming to a close on Sammy D's silk press. I want y'all to stay tuned because they look real cute. She gonna get a little trim today too. She needs a trim, but it's looking beautiful. So just wanted to pop in and let you guys see that good flow. Last couple pieces. Sorry, it's my alarm to do my Khan Academy. <laughs> At least you've been setting an alarm for it. I always thing. do for everything. Like now I'm actually using the phones for some extra intended purposes. This one is the business right here, boy. I can't believe I was gonna just give it up. No, I can't be doing that. Okay, find uh, something else. Ma'am, ma'am, where are you taking my flatter, ma'am? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That could have been Oh my goodness, my color is tea. I told you we were gonna see it. Right? Uh, that's not well, a type of color that's since... reflective on curly hair. Yeah, you have to have more like highlights. We've straightened it since I got this color, but I didn't really look like this before. Be a whole other person, boy. Like it all the time. Do not mess with her. She is the one. All right, I think I'm gonna have you stand up. Like, what? I'm gonna have you guys put both feet together. There to go. Okay. Look at how long you look so freaking tall and with your hair straight. Oh my gosh, it's getting college vibes. Absolutely. For real. Oh, you don't see what I see. Just some okay. minimal I'm to here. Please. <laughs> I'm, I'm the professional here. Hold this right here. No, these pieces that I'm holding. This one on this side. I yeah, can't hold it out. There you go. No, so I'm trying to give it to you. Like you. you. Yes. No movement. You're definitely getting tall. I do a little bit of elevation just to get like those top. That's what gives you that weight and it don't look like just a little straight. Okay, I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna do the bottom, the bottom. Oh my gosh. That felt like I was going down on an elevator. See how we're bolting here. At this point, cut off as much as you need to because it's all damaged. It's not terrible, it's just the ankle. You know, whenever it curls, it doesn't need to curl. That was a lot. But it was all string. Like, you're still gonna have like that bang look. It's just like this right here. That's just strings. It's not a lot. You could remember I had bought the same one that I was using just now. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, no, I want this one. That's the shorter piece on there, too. I mean, I trimmed it. I'm just saying you could use more, but just let it grow and then trim it again in like a couple months. You just need to be keeping an eye on your hair and like recognizing if you still feel it like at the same length. Because that could mean that it is splitting on the bottom. I feel like my hair is always at the same length though. Yeah, they have to be. I just don't know. You don't take care of your scalp. You gotta take care of your scalp in order for your hair to grow. Like everything is not just about what the hair looks like on the ends. Like all that stimulation that I was doing was to increase blood flow mm -hmm. to the scalp, which is what creates a healthy environment for the hair to grow. Look okay, down this hair. I don't want to do it all together. There's like different layers. Look down the, to the right. Look to your right. Yeah, kind of right there. Look down here. Right here. I'm just looking at your Yeah, I really. So I'm gonna wax my chin and you're just gonna kind of clean up and kind of spruce up. Cute! Cute! Oh the color though is so good. I can't, I can't do it. Final serum. And like all these just kind of make them look neat, neat and spray the hair out of it. Put the blow dryer if you can. In this sort of situation. I'm just gonna keep on the spot, I guess. Right? What? I mean, look over there. The blow dryer. George, with the fabulous hair. I mean, you do good with your hair anyway, but it's nice to see a little, little change. I'm not going to the game. I don't want to mess up my hair. Like, I'm just not going to go. I'm going to have FOMO so bad, but I can't look at it. I mean, no. It's like, gosh, you snapped. Oh, I snapped? It looks so cute. <gasps> see, back in the day, snap meant like somebody got mad or something. <laughs> now it's a good thing. Okay, well, it can be good or bad, realistically, like, you know? 
She's got a nice cropped, healthy length. We're gonna be trimming um, every couple of months because she does need to keep her ends trimmed. But Samara be doing her own hair, y'all. She does so good. I'm actually impressed with her having taken care of her hair this long, how healthy it is, so. 